Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Chris, and thank you for watching my video. Alright guys, if you saw the um, couple of videos I made before New Year's, I was predicting there was going to be a big dip in silver. Now, it did go up the other day, so I was wrong with the timing, but I guess considering I was only off by a day, I would have to say I, I had a feeling. That's why I thought it was so strange yesterday that silver and gold was going up, because I really thought that when the average people out there saw this fiscal cliff solving as some kind of savior and, you know, avoiding the, the cliff, that people would start feeling more empowered, think that the dollar was going to be more valuable, and you'd see a sell-off of precious metals. Now, that's exactly what you're seeing today. Um, pretty big moves right as of now. You're seeing gold right now down over $23 at 1663 um, we're seeing silver dropped about 65 cents now at around $30.40. So, like I said, guys, I had a feeling there was going to be a dip. Yesterday, I guess, was just one of those weird kind of anomalies. It just didn't make sense. And you could see that the euro has dropped one point. It was at 1.31 and about, um, about 1.315. And now it's down to 1.306. So it's lost the whole point. So that means the dollar has gained a little bit in strength. So I have a feeling that uh, we're going to see even a larger dip in the next day or so. I don't think silver will go down past 28. I just really don't think it's going to get that low. But um, there is going to be a buying opportunity. So for those of you who missed that first one before Christmas, looks like you'll be getting another Christmas present. Like I've said, um, this is a corrupt system, so they don't want it to be rising too quick. And as long as as the people in charge who are manipulating the paper prices can affect the system obviously you can see that's exactly what they're gonna do so this is why you don't put emotion into it you just just wait it out and see that when you know how the enemy works they're pretty reliable and you know they're pretty predictable so I at least admitted I was wrong as far as the day but if you look at it this way I was telling people that once they solve the fiscal cliff you would expect a dip I was off by one day, so I think in the grand scheme of things, that's not bad. So if you were looking for a buying opportunity again and you thought you missed the boat, well, you could thank the powers that be that are in control of the manipulation because they're giving you an early uh, Christmas present for 2013. So I'm going to leave this video short, leave your messages after the beep, and if you didn't get this stack last week or last month, looks like you're going to have an opportunity now, especially in gold, because when I was telling people to buy right before Christmas, gold was around, I think, 1676 and now it's at 1664 so it's a little bit cheaper so it really doesn't matter when you buy it if you're looking for protection of wealth and you're looking against the potential collapse of the um, US dollar or the world economies but getting it cheaper just means you have more money in your pocket to buy more or buy something else like food uh, anything so let's leave it at that thanks for watching guys enjoy your day peace out